Hello and welcome to India Food Network. You're watching Veggie World with me, Arena. Today I'm going to do a classic Indian appetizer, hara bhara kebab. So if you want to know what goes in, stay tuned. So let's have a look at the ingredients we need to make hara bhara kebab. Half a cup paneer crumbled, about two medium-sized boiled potatoes grated or mashed, half a cup spinach puree. Salt to taste. One teaspoon each of green chilli and ginger paste. About a couple of pinches of amchur powder. Coriander leaves. Few cashew nuts for garnish. Dried flour for coating and oil for deep frying. Let's start with the grated potatoes. The crumbled paneer. Ginger and green chilli paste. Salt. Two pinches of amchur or dry mango powder. Just a small handful of coriander leaves, and finally the blanched spinach puree. Now to mix the dough well. Now that everything is mixed well, if you think it's a little sticky or loose, you can just add like a spoon of dry flour. Till it's slightly dry. I think now mine is still a little sticky, so let me adjust the consistency with a little dry flour. Just starting with little at a time. If your potatoes are very very sticky, then you can just add dry poha, which soaks up the stickiness very fast. But now I think it's done. So we'll just shape it into tikkis and deep fry it. I've just taken a few drops of oil in my hand, and I'm just going to grease them. Depending on the size of the tikkis that you want, just take a little bit of a portion. And we'll just roll it in dry flour. Now these won't retain shape so much. You have to be very, very careful because they are quite delicate and soft. Once it's coated, we'll take half the cashew and press it in. This way, we'll just shape a few and keep. Now that the kebabs are shaped, let's deep fry them. Let's start by heating the oil in the kadhai. Now that the oil is hot, we'll add We'll have to just fry these till they are golden brown and they're slightly crisp on the outside. You see that's starting to catch color a little. Just a few seconds more and it should be done. If you don't like to deep fry, you can also shallow fry them. They seem to be ready. We we'll just get them out. Here you go, hara bhara kebab ready for your party. If you like this recipe and would like to learn more, subscribe to India Food Network. Do write into us with any feedback you may have. Till then, keep watching Veggie World.